everybody welcome to my youtube channel my name is job caleb i hope this message meets you in the peace of jesus i have been going through all this uh these pages and pages of information uh that the lord has been giving me since he called me about eight months ago and there's a lot it's a lot so i've come up with a pretty good word today uh i think you'll be interested in this one uh first of all i'll say, I'll say a, a word of prayer Father, I ask you to speak through me, to, to guide me in what I say, that I might impart wisdom and knowledge to your people and strengthen their faith. In Jesus' name, amen. Welcome again to my YouTube channel. Please hit the like, subscribe, uh, and join the family. So this one's going to get people excited. On September 17th, the Lord said, Bitcoin, they're going to replace it. And then he said, I am the truth. So he did mention a possible replacement, uh, but I'll get to that after I go into I am the truth. So you're going to have to hold on for that. Uh, I am the truth comes from uh, John 14. Uh, it's six. I'll read one through six. Let not your heart be troubled. You believe in God. Believe also in me. In my father's house are many mansions. If it were not so, I would have told you. I go to prepare a place for you, and if I go to prepare a place for you, I will come again and receive you to myself, that where I am, there you may be also. And where I go, you go, where I go, you know, and the way you know. Thomas said to him, Lord, we do not know where you are going. How can we know the way? Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. He is the truth, and he is so good. Okay, so on the 22nd, uh, he said H-bar. So I believe uh, this is a continuity of, of, of message, and the way he talks to me, it's like a puzzle. I have to go through, and I have to put everything together, and it's, I mean, it's so much. There's just pages and pages and pages. Um so he said H-bar. I believe uh, he was answering the question that I had when I asked him what they're going to replace it with. So uh, it's not financial advice, but I tell you what, after I make some profit on XRP, I'm going to buy some H-bar. That's what I'm going to do. You can do what you want. All right. So um, on the 23rd of September, I saw, uh, or no, he spoke this. It was the number to me, and I think this was the next day after he said H-bar, so I think this could be related. Uh, he said 1348. Uh, H-1348, it means, I don't know why I didn't write down the word. Sorry about that. I'm new at this. H-1348 in Strong's means column, excellent things, majesty, proud, or swelling. So, um, oh, and the, and the Greek is dikastes, which means judge. Uh, this is not the first number he's communicated uh, to me through. The first number he communicated me uh, to me through was July 1st, 2021. Um, and this actually fits in with a question. Uh, one of my new subscribers, welcome to all the new subscribers, asked me, uh, if, did the Lord teach you or ask you, or I'm sorry, did the Lord tell you to go to school? Um, and yes, he did. It was actually around the same time, July 1st, 2021. As I woke up, this is the first number that I saw. I saw 575 in front of my eyes, right as I woke up. So um, I was wondering, you know, if I should look at the Greek or the Hebrew. And I was in my kitchen. It was real early in the morning, like 1:15 in the morning, and the Lord said Greek to me uh, at 1:15 in the morning. So I looked up the Greek, and this is right as He was revealing His plan and promise for my life, which includes. Uh, leaving right now I'm in a hotel uh, and it includes uh, going to Chicago to go to Bible school and he's he's got a house for me there he says so uh, that's that's a pretty awesome promise but 575 the Greek means or it's Apo I believe I'm saying that right I haven't been to school yet but I'm going uh, Apo from or away from I was kind of scared at this time because uh, I, I tore my arm pretty bad and I couldn't work and I had not, I didn't realize yet that I had entered the Lord's rest. He was breaking it to me kind of slowly. So he tells me, I, I mean, I was, I was frightened. I've been homeless before, and I, I thought it was coming again. 
Uh, I was laying in bed like all day long, just dreading like what was going to happen. Uh, he told me, uh, you have a father who loves you. Prosperity. Celebrate. You don't have to worry about anything. And next he said, go to school. And this was, uh, I think, on July 3rd. He said, you don't have to worry about anything. Go to school. So that's when he told me to go to school. And then the next day, I was in bed. Uh, it was, I was still kind of scared and not really moving around a lot. I was really depressed. And he, that's when he told me where to go to school. He said, Moody Bible Institute, Chicago and Michigan. I had never heard of Moody Bible Institute. I, I don't know anything about I mean, I do now, but at the time I didn't know. So he told me uh, the school, where it is. He said it's in Chicago and Michigan. And he said, search them. So that's how the Lord told me to go to Bible school. He's told me uh, also, I don't have the date, but he has spoken uh, that he told me to sell all my stuff. I, I used to have an eBay store. And he told me one day, he said, uh, eBay, you don't need it. Because I was kind of scrambling to try to you know, get enough money to pay my rent. So I gave away all that stuff. He said, get rid of all this stuff and start a church. He's told me more than once that I'm going to uh, get enough to start a church. But he's also told me I'm going to have to give it back. So uh, the Lord gives and the Lord takes away and uh, everything belongs to him. So we should be good stewards. Uh, I am accepting donations. Uh, I really need it, and but I don't want you to do it unless the Lord leads you to do it. Uh, there are ways to donate uh, in the box below. So, Moody Bible Institute in Chicago. Like, like I said, once again, I, I welcome all the new subscribers. Thank you for following me. Please pray for me. Uh, pray for uh, a financial miracle because I need it. <laughs> uh, but I, I just know that the Lord is going to take care of me, and that's what we have to do. Uh, he tells me to celebrate. He, he tells me uh, I've entered his rest, and, and there's nothing to worry about. Right now, what I'm doing is possessing the land. So I have to go, go in and possess the land. So there's, it's going to be accompanied with signs and wonders. Um, like I said yesterday, uh, thank you for bearing with me as I learn how to do this and, and put all this information together. I love you all, and uh, God bless you.